If you have anger issues, this one now, good news with a sweet belly. Yes, I mean, the one with the totori belly. And guys, this good news is accompanied with an interesting testimony. Yay! guys good news is that okay first of all we know a few months ago um chacha ak fanny left her husband's house i do not want to go into that details right now honestly i'm here for the good news and just for the good news so the good news is that chacha ak fanny our very own asian wine has reunited with austin fanny guys are you happy <laughs> i'm so happy i'm excited about this and the second testimony that accompanied this one is that they both stormed house on the rock asaba where she talked about a lot of things anyway and she gave beautiful testimony interesting testimony about austin fanny about her marriage with austin fanny and all of that and she also sees that opportunity to you know unveil or talk about her foundation which she called meticulous people foundation guys without further ado without many talking let me allow you guys to hear it all by yourself and trust me all by himself just lover the man to a toy has confirmed this gist guys enjoy the video and let me know what you think about this reunion are you as happy as i am guys let me know what you think in the comment section if you're coming across the channel for the first time thank you for choosing to stop by please do consider subscribing like the video share the video and for my amazing amazing returning subscribers thanks for always tuning in at the Reef hotel and home new heaven i was lost in a suit with my husband and my two children at that time and then one day it happened i went back Later on, I discovered this whole immediate episode, but just like in the movies, I went bonkers, crazy. I began to throw away every of our belongings, clothes, shoes, bags, the children's toys, and vandalized the hotel properties. The suit in the parlor area had three large cushions. I ripped it all apart using a tiny knife. It was nothing but madness. That madness was contained in just that room by my husband, who was wearing only the clothes I had on when I was trying to wear the Singles for my children. That incident was so intense that what I needed was a trip to the hospital. But I didn't go to the hospital because my husband and I, who is seated here with me, support me. We are attributed into demonic attack. Fuji. <laughs> Marine spirit. Somebody or somewhere. Now for that. Oh, it's my You know you can get me MPC If you have anger issues. I'm talking high temper, the kind that will never go away except you take out your vexation on something or someone. Darling, you have mental illness. If you feel bitter and saddened to the extent that you inflict injury on self, baby, you got mental illness. If you are out of touch with reality you have paranoia hallucinations delusions your thought patterns are dysfunctional the mood swings never end with you that is a mental illness if you recognize one two or more of these traits that i just mentioned in yourself and for fear of being stigmatized as you refuse to align with the truth you'll be doing yourself a great disservice mental illness can be inherited it can be acquired trauma intense trauma can give one mental illness poverty can give one mental illness living a hectic lifestyle can give one mental illness and yes of course just like asthma sickle cell anemia ulcer diabetes and all kinds of sicknesses the brain too gets sick 
the brain cells need pills to function properly and so there are pills for this illnesses so if you fall under this category please by all means necessary get medical attention because somebody just died put kerosene herself and that was it this would not have happened if she was on the pills